I'm here in downtown Portland, Oregon, and uh, I grew up in Oregon, went to college at George Fox University, so I was in downtown Portland a lot. And to be here after over 120 nights of protests, many of which, maybe most of which, have been deemed riots, where many, many people have been injured, and I'm just seeing window after window that's been boarded up because it was broken into with all the looting, millions upon millions of dollars worth of things looted. And um, I'm, he I'm standing here where Jay Danielson was murdered by someone who declared himself 100% Antifa. And so we are here in uh, the Festival of Booths. I know the Lord is honored that we celebrate his birth with our calendar. We're 2,020 years after the birth of the Lord Jesus. But God likes his own calendar too. It started a few weeks ago with Rosh Hashanah, the, the head of the year, 5781. I think I got that right. And then you have the 10 days of awe where people are called to repent of their sins, to return to Jesus. In fact, we were, we were in Washington, D.C., on the day of Shabbat Shukot. I think I got that right. It is the Sabbath of return, the day that people are called to return to the Lord. And there were over 100,000, some estimate as many as 250,000 Christians on the National Monument calling for our nation to return to the Lord. And so I just want to blow the shofar for the Feast of Booths this comes after Yom Kippur, the Day of Atonement, the day that the people, after 10 days of giving their lives back to the Lord, it is a Day of Atonement and now the Festival of Booths. To come into the presence of the Lord, uh, His people would live in booths for a week, tents, to remind themselves of how God preserved them for 40 years in the desert after delivering them from Egypt. And so I want to blow the shofar over Portland, Oregon, to welcome his peace as a, as a prayer that people will return to him and take their shelter in him. Baruch Hata Adonai Elohenu Melech HaOlam Asher Kidshenu Bamitzvatav Vitzivanu Lachitatet Batsitzit